Today I will be using the low porosity line for Elaine hair and body. I wasn't sure if I had low or high porosity hair, but she was kind enough to help me figure it out. And so now I know. I am starting out with the shampoo, of course, which I put in my applicator bottle like I always do. It is called the Clarifying Shampoo and it says this sulfate free clarifying shampoo gently cleanses and removes product buildup. Perfect for low porosity hair that has a hard time retaining moisture. Enriched with nourishing mango buddy, mango buddy, <laughs> mango butter, sweet almond oil, coconut oil to hydrate your hair with every wash. And I can't say that I was surprised by how nicely it lathered up because you know a lot of sulfate free shampoos don't immediately lather up especially on old dirty hair so i was really surprised by that and it was nice and soft on my hair but i can say be careful not to get it in your eye because that's what i did and that hurt yeah my eye was irritated <laughs> but the shampoo itself was really nice and i really liked it and I could really see myself like adding this shampoo to the routine. But since it is a clarifying shampoo, I might use it like once a month, not every wash day. Next, I will be using the hair mask, which I was really excited about because I've never used like a hair mask or any type of clay product on my hair. I don't know if like every hair mask has like clay in it, but this one has bentonite clay in it. And I've heard a lot of good things about using clay on your hair. So yeah, I couldn't wait to try this one out. And it says, get rid of product buildup with our hair mask formulated to bring out your natural curls, remove impurities and leave your hair detangled, soft, moisturized and smooth I liked it overall I liked it I mean I don't know what to expect from a hair mask but I liked it it did actually leave my hair like really soft all of these products left my hair like really soft though so yeah Then I just get my good old plastic bag and cover it for like, I'm gonna stop saying like for about uh, 30 minutes to an hour. Next I am using the deep conditioner because the hair mask said to follow it up with the deep conditioner. So, for me, this deep conditioner didn't have enough slip for me because this is usually when I like to detangle my hair. I know it's not supposed to be a detangler, but this is when I detangle my hair. But I could easily fix that by adding like an oil to it. I didn't do it in this video because I wanted to use these products by themselves so I could see exactly how they work on my hair. And it's just a little bit thinner than I'm used to. I'm used to like thicker, heavier products on my hair and this one was just like a little bit thin and not as much slip to me and yeah but it did leave my hair like really soft and feeling good it was just a little bit harder to detangle than i'm used to and i forgot to mention all of these products do have like a perfumey kind of scent so if you're not big on strong fragrances then you might have a problem with it, it kind of smells like a perfume that my mom would wear <laughs> it doesn't smell bad at all but it just kind of smells like a perfume my mom wore. And the smell does linger, like after you're done and your hair is dry. But I must say it smells a lot better once your hair is dry. Because after my hair is dry, I actually did like the smell of it a lot better than I did when it was wet.
And you'll see, because it didn't really detangle as easily and smoothly as I wanted to, I kind of had to go back to finger detangling a little bit in between using the comb. Back to that plastic bag I go. And I left this one on for about... I ain't gonna lie. I left it on for like two or three hours. <laughs> the directions say about 30 minutes, but I always go over them times. And now I am using the leave-in, which is a spray. I'm not really used to using like spray leave-ins. This was my first time for something like that. And I really did like it. Again, it made my hair soft, but I'm used to like heavier things. This would be nice if you're trying to refresh your hair. Like on actual wash day, I might use a heavier leave-in and then during the refreshing part, I would use this spray leave-in like in the middle of the week. Then after the spray leave-in I showed you a little bit earlier, I used the hair moisturizer and along the line with the rest of the products, it's rather lightweight. Like I keep saying, I've probably said it a jillion times. You're probably tired of me saying it. But I'm kind of used to like thicker, heavier creams. And this would be like along the lines with the spray leave-in. I would use this to freshen up my hair in the middle of the week. And these are the results of taking those twists down with only the Elaine hair and body products. This is what my hair looks like. I must say my hair was like really, really soft. It was really soft. But my only thing is everything was so lightweight that it kind of makes me feel like the moisture wouldn't last and I would have to freshen up and re-moisturize my hair in like two days. 
But yeah, it did have my hair like really soft. I said I was gonna stop saying like, but it did have my hair really soft. That part I did like. The shampoo is a thumbs up for me, just don't get it in your eye. The hair mask, I like that one a lot because, I don't know, maybe I'm just excited to use clay on my hair. <laughs> but I really do like that one a lot and everything made my hair really soft. The only thing that, I don't know, maybe I had an issue with was the deep conditioner because it wasn't really thick and it didn't have a lot of slip to it. That's probably like the only one that I kind of had an issue with because it kind of made my detangling take a lot longer than it usually does and it was more work to detangle especially having to go back to finger detangling so yeah everything else was a thumbs up for me and the leave-in and the moisturizer like i said would be more of a refresher in the middle of the week i hope you like this review and demo thank you for watching and this was just a quick little simple little style that i need wanted to show <laughs> with my hair I don't know. It's not that good, but yeah, that's what I did. Thank you for watching.